Welcome to Canon in Studio. Today it's time for a newly launched BMC 2017 endurance bike called the Road Machine. And yes, BMC already had the endurance model called Grand Fondo, but this one comes with so many features that there was really a point of making a completely new model. Uh, and at least two of those features I'm going to show you right now we haven't really seen so far on any other bike, at least made in this way. So it's going to be exciting, I'm going to break down for you guys differences between different models so that you will be able to find the right one for you. Now Road Machine, that's the bike um, developed by BMC along with Cadill Evans and they did it with a great precision because it sits exactly between the Team Machine, which is their uh, racing bike, and the Grand Fondo, which is the uh, endurance bike. Now, um, here is the road machine. It doesn't really replace the Grand Fondo, but it has to be updated very, very soon because in my opinion, no one would really care about buying this one having so many cool stuff on the road machine. So let's just find out what these uh, features are. When we click the new road machine on the official website of BMC, we'll see some basic infos on uh, on this bike and I would say comfort, efficiency and they've been working a lot on the look and integration uh, and you will see why just uh, in a second. There is some intro video here and basic information of those model models. Basically we have three lines uh, 01, 02 and 03. Uh, I already have some uh, comparison tool right now, right here. So 01 and 02 are the carbon bikes, 03 is the, the aluminum bike. Uh, as you can expect, 01 will be the, the one with premium carbon, uh, which means more of the high modulus carbon fibers. Uh, 02 will have uh, less uh, high modulus uh, carbon fibers. And the alloy bike is triple butted, um, hydroformed with smooth welds and the carbon fork, so it's still very, very cool bike. What are, are the features that all those uh, three models or lines really share? The first one is the TCC, which stands for Tuned uh, Compliance uh, Concepts. So all three bikes are made for better comfort, shaping of those tubes and also the angles of this uh, frame set geometry enhances comfort. Now all three bikes have uh, disc brakes and they only come with disc brakes. Then all three bikes come with 20 millimeters through axle, which is super cool. Um, so these bikes, these bikes will be really, really stiff. And now let's just look at some uh, more features. Of course, the tire clearance will be the topic uh, here. So 30 millimeters tire clearance for 01 and 02 and 32 millimeters for 03, the Allen one. Um, then flat mount disc brakes uh, and then O2 will have hidden fender mounts and O3 will have hidden fender and rack mounts. So really versatile machine, super super cool. cool. When we scroll down here to this PDF file we'll see all those informations right here uh, and I'm gonna show you now those features. So when we look at the uh, O1 model uh, to make a long story short once more, we have comfort uh, at the seat post, rear triangle and the fork and then stiffness uh, for power transfer here, stiffness for handling and cornering and braking here and then integration for the look which is here in the cockpit and the seat post clamp that also enhances, enhances the, uh, the uh, comfort. Now this model uh, the uh, the O1 model have uh, it's that's the only one with the integration uh, cockpit, and this is uh, how the cockpit looks like. It's really really cool, and I have never seen uh, done this cable routing so neatly. So I see uh, it integrated cockpit and stem. This is how it looks like. Um, the uh, clamp of the stamp is also done um, only for two bolts and also uh, you'll be able to mount like uh, your Garmin, your computer, your camera, sport camera here. Really, really well thought out, super design. Uh, I like it so much. Uh, now in terms of the uh, integrated cockpit uh, system here, it's unfortunately only the 
uh, 01DI2 model that will have all the cables hidden. As you can see, you can see that you, can, you cannot see <laughs> the cables because both braking cables and the shifting cables the electro from the electronical group set uh, are hidden inside the frame. Now, uh, when we look at the, uh, the model with the mechanical group set, uh, you will still have those uh, braking cables hidden, but the shifting cable is already uh, outside. I mean, outside the uh, head tube, uh, but of course there is internal cable routing. Uh, sorry, my computer isn't really so quick. There is internal cable routing, but you can see the cable here. It doesn't go through this uh, stem or actually it should go under the stem with this with a small uh, with a small uh, cover there so it's really really cool also the website is done very very neatly because you can see all those highlights you can scroll down to the technologies and then uh, these are the technologies TCC that's for all three uh, bikes dual transmission integration that's for carbon bikes they will be just prepared the frame set for both mechanical and electronical group set and integrated cockpit system is only for 01. Then you have technical uh, details. Uh, you can click geometry and when you click concept, don't forget to click, click the concept because you can really find some really, really nice information about everything. The weight, the, um, what kind of tapering uh, is there on those bikes. So I really like it. It's really, really helpful. BMC, bravo for this website. It's super helpful for the buyer. Uh, all right, so we already know that uh, it's only the O1 that has integrated cockpit, but then O1 and O2 will have some other cool feature that is called dual stack. And dual stack uh, means that you have some special design of the stem uh, and some spacer that will allow you to put your, um, your handlebar or your stem in two different positions, actually changing the stack like a bit changing the length of the head tube and that's really really cool it comes with 01 and 02 model it doesn't come for the uh, 03 01 and 02 will also have d-shaped uh, carbon seat post for more um, compliance uh, and these are basically uh, the differences between so between 01 02 and 03 uh, now there is some really nice graph here showing us the differences between Grand Fondo, Team Machine and Road Machine. As you can see, uh, geometry-wise it really sits in between. I'm going to tell you a bit more about geometry in a second. But uh, about the performance, uh, that's the uh, weight of the frame. So um, 790 for Team Machine, uh, 1050 for the Grand Fondo and 930 for, um, for, t uh, for the um, Road Machine 01. Then Road Machine 02 will have the weight of 1100 grams for the carbon frame and 03 the other one uh, will weigh 1250 grams, so 1250 grams. As you can see the comfort is just between the uh, team machine and Grand Fondo. Acceleration stiffness is between and handling is between. So of course these are these are only the graphs uh, and you know what the journalists riding those bikes tell you that they feel it exactly. I, I wouldn't really um, believe that uh, but yes the bike has been designed to really sit between like super comfy Grand Fondo and super racy uh, team machine. So these are the features. Now one thing super important here is to remember that those uh, two bikes, 01 and 02, will have same geometry and 03 will have different geometry because this one doesn't have this double stack system. So when you compare the uh, 01 and 03 geometry, let's say for the 54 size, you will see like stack 571 and stack for 01 will be either 560 or 576 because you can put it, put your stem in, in two different positions. So remember about that 01 and 02, same geometry, but 03 will be, will have geometry that will put you like in between this double stack system on 01 and 03. So that's uh, important and I hope 
that this is also helpful for you guys. So if you wonder about anything, weight of the fork, weight of the frame, you can always click the, the concept here on any model and they will really give you all those infos here. So once more, Comfort, disc brakes, through axles, uh, this TCC uh, system and integrated cockpit super, super nicely uh, looking for the O1 uh, model, especially with the i2 system, completely like wireless looking. Thanks for watching guys, uh, please give me some thumbs up if you like uh, my work and, and those uh, reviews, online Bane reviews, based reviews and I will see you soon in the next episode. See ya.